Standard conditions for temperature and pressure are standard sets of conditions for experimental measurements to be established to allow comparisons to be made between different sets of data. The most used standards are those of the International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry and the National Institute of Standards and Technology although these are not universally accepted standards. Other organizations have established a variety of alternative definitions for their standard reference conditions. In chemistry, IUPAC changed the definition of standard temperature and pressure in 1982. Until 1982, STP was defined as a temperature of 273.15 K, 0 degrees Celsius, 32 degrees Fahrenheit, and an absolute pressure of exactly 1 atmosphere, 1.01325 times 105 pascals. Since 1982, STP is defined as a temperature of 273.15 K, 0 degrees Celsius, 32 degrees Fahrenheit, and an absolute pressure of exactly 105 pascals, 100 kilopascals, one bar. STP should not be confused with the standard state commonly used in thermodynamic evaluations of the Gibbs energy of a reaction. NIST uses a temperature of 20 degrees Celsius, 293.15 K, 68 degree F, and an absolute pressure of 1 atmosphere, 14.696 psi, 101.325 kilopascals. This standard is also called normal temperature and pressure, abbreviated as NTP. The international standard metric conditions for natural gas and similar fluids are 288.15 K, 15.00 degrees Celsius, 59.00 degrees Fahrenheit, and 101.325 kilopascals. In industry and commerce, standard conditions for temperature and pressure are often necessary to define the standard reference conditions to express the volumes of gases and liquids and related quantities such as the rate of volumetric flow. The volumes of gases vary significantly with temperature and pressure standard cubic meters per second sm3 per seconds and normal cubic meters per second cubic nanometer per second however many technical publications books journals advertisements for equipment and machinery simply state standard conditions without specifying them often leading to confusion and errors good practice always incorporates the reference conditions of temperature and pressure definitions Past uses Before 1918, many professionals and scientists using the metric system of units defined the standard reference conditions of temperature and pressure for expressing gas volumes as being 15 degrees Celsius 288.15 K, 59.00 degrees Fahrenheit and 101.325 kilopascals 1.00 atmospheres, 760 torr. During those same years, the most commonly used standard reference conditions for people using the imperial or U.S. customary systems was 60 degrees Fahrenheit 15.56 degrees Celsius, 288.71 K and 14.696 psi one atmosphere because it was almost universally used by the oil and gas industries worldwide. The above definitions are no longer the most commonly used in either system of units. Current use. Many different definitions of standard reference conditions are currently being used by organizations all over the world. The table below lists a few of them, but there are more. Some of these organizations used other standards in the past. For example, IUPAC has, since 1982, defined standard reference conditions as being 0 degrees Celsius and 100 kilopascals one bar, in contrast to its old standard of 0 degrees Celsius and 101.325 kilopascals one atmosphere. Natural gas companies in Europe, Australia, and South America have adopted 15 degrees Celsius 59 degrees Fahrenheit and 101.325 kilopascals 14.696 PSI as their standard gas volume reference conditions, used as the base values for defining the standard cubic meter. Also, the International Organization for Standardization ISO, the United States Environmental Protection Agency EPA, and National Institute of Standards and Technology NIST each have more than one definition of standard reference conditions in their various standards and regulations. Notes 
EGIA, Electricity and Gas Inspection Act of Canada. SATP, Standard Ambient Temperature and Pressure. SCF, Standard Cubic Foot. International Standard Atmosphere. In aeronautics and fluid dynamics, the International Standard Atmosphere ESA, is a specification of pressure, temperature, density, and speed of sound at each altitude. The International Standard Atmosphere is representative of atmospheric conditions at mid latitudes. In the USA, this information is specified the U.S. Standard Atmosphere, which is identical to the International Standard Atmosphere at all altitudes up to 65,000 feet above sea level. Standard laboratory conditions Due to the fact that many definitions of standard temperature and pressure differ in temperature significantly from standard laboratory temperatures e.g., 0 degrees Celsius versus approximately 25 degrees Celsius, reference is often made to standard laboratory conditions. A term deliberately chosen to be different from the term, "...standard conditions for temperature and pressure", despite its semantic near-identity when interpreted literally. However, what is a "...standard?" Laboratory temperature and pressure is inevitably geography-bound, given that different parts of the world differ in climate, altitude and the degree of use of heat, cooling in the workplace. For example, schools in New South Wales, Australia use 25 degrees Celsius at 100 kPa for standard laboratory conditions. ASTM International has published standard ASTM E41 terminology relating to conditioning and hundreds of special conditions for particular materials and test methods. Other standards organizations also have specialized standard test conditions. Molar volume of a gas It is equally as important to indicate the applicable reference conditions of temperature and pressure when stating the molar volume of a gas as it is when expressing a gas volume or volumetric flow rate. Stating the molar volume of a gas without indicating the reference conditions of temperature and pressure has very little meaning and can cause confusion. The molar volume of gases around STP and at atmospheric pressure can be calculated with an accuracy that is usually sufficient by using the ideal gas law. The molar volume of any ideal gas may be calculated at various standard reference conditions as shown below. Vm 8.3145 times 273.15, 101.325 cubic decimeters per mole at 0 degrees Celsius and 101.325 kPa Vm 8.3145 times 273.15, 100.000. 1 22.711 cubic decimeters per mole at 0 degrees Celsius and 100 kPa Vm. 8.3145 times 298.15, 101.325 24.466 cubic decimeters per mole at 25 degrees Celsius and 101.325 kPa Vm 8.3145 times 298.15, 100.000. 24.790 1 cubic decimeters per mole at 25 degrees Celsius and 100 kPa Vm. 10.7316 times 519.67, 14.696. 379.48 feet 3, lbmol at 60 degrees Fahrenheit and 14.696 psi or about 0.8366 feet 3 per grams mole. Vm. 
10.7316 times 519.67, 14.730. Three hundred seventy eight point six one feet three LBMOL at sixty degrees Fahrenheit and fourteen seventy three. Cytechnical literature can be confusing because many authors fail to explain whether they are using the ideal gas constant R or the specific gas constant R's. The relationship between the two constants is R's equals R per meter, where m is the molecular mass of the gas. The U.S. Standard Atmosphere USSA uses 8.31432 cubic meters pa, mol k as the value of R. However, the USSA, 1976 does recognize that this value is not consistent with the values of the Avogadro constant and the Boltzmann constant. See also Atmospheric models Environmental chamber ISO 1 standard reference temperature for geometric product specifications Standard state Standard sea level Room temperature Notes References External links Standard conditions for gases. From the IUPAC Gold Book. Standard pressure. From the IUPAC Gold Book. STP. From the IUPAC Gold Book. Standard state. From the IUPAC Gold Book.